Hey everyone, welcome back or welcome if you're new. My name is Sarah and I am a budgeting mom of girls. On this channel, I will be showing you how we use the zero-based budgeting method, cash stuffing, and savings challenges to get our family out of debt and achieve financial freedom. If this is something that interests you, I would love for you to join us on our journey. Good morning, everybody. Today, we are going to be cash stuffing 1,176. Um, when I did my budget with me uh, video, we were going to be stuffing 1,181. However, I spent $5 of our grocery money already. Um, my youngest daughter had some of her friends stay the night last night um, for their Galentine's party. So, they're still sleeping. So, I'm, gonna, I'm trying to uh, hurry up and get this done before they wake up. So let's start with um, my change purse and my wallet. So I don't think I have very much change in here, but every little bit counts. That's my, my uh, motto for this year. So we'll throw that right in there. And then I think I actually do have some money in my wallet for the first time in forever. So I have money left in eating out five dollars and then in happy hours I have a dollar so we're gonna put that right to extra debt oh and I keep forgetting to talk about this I have a ton of uh, receipts I need to scan into my fetch rewards and um, oh goodness receipt hog uh, apps and I have my referral code link below um if you use my referral code not only do you get bonus points but i get a bonus points as well just to be transparent with you um it's a really easy way to earn some gift cards for free just by scanning receipts and that's it you earn points and then you get gift cards so it's pretty awesome all right over to the side i'm using my cash planning sheet that i filled out for during my budget video so that's what i'll be referencing off the camera I can hear them waking up down there. I better hurry. Sorry if this is gonna feel rushed. <laughs> All right, so we're starting with eating out and eating out is gonna get a 50, two 20s, a 10, and two fives. And hopefully that is correct. So now in eating out, we have 50, 70, 90, 100, five, and 10. I love it when it works out like that. All right, next up is drinks, and that's going to get three 20s and a 10, so that should be 70 that it has. 20, 40, 60, and 70. Uh, entertainment is going to get uh, it's a lowly little $10. Maybe we can double it tonight. Who knows? <laughs> I feel like we spend it as fast as I put it in there. Um, happy hour is getting 25, and we're going to do a 10, um, two fives and five ones so that should be 25 10 15 20 1 2 3 4 and 5 perfect supplements is going to get 25 as well so we're just doing a 20 and a 5 and then g is going to get 20 and that's just going to be two tens and for those that are new, N and G um, are my daughters. Um, and they just get a little bit of fun money every week. I try to put some in there. So like today, my husband and I will probably go out to an early dinner 
Um, and that money they'll probably use to go, I don't know. They usually go to Taco Bell or McDonald's for their little treats. So whatever it is, what it is. They love being able to do that. So, um, and then Betty and Ivy are my kitty cats. Um, in one of my previous videos, Betty actually made an appearance. So I was thinking that she was going to do that again because she followed me upstairs to, to do this. <laughs> Okay, we're not stuffing school and sports, but we are putting $5. Like I already said, I spent $5 already out of here. So $5 in groceries and $5 in math. And this is my husband. He's got some birthday money left in there. So now he has $105. We're just going to sneak that right on in there. And that's it for our everyday binder. Next up is going to be our purple binder. And again, I apologize if I feel like I'm rushing through this, but I promised them I would make them breakfast. So I gotta get this done so I can get down there and make them breakfast. So the first one in here is Gretchen's car. Um, and today she's gonna get 200 and we're just gonna do two $100 bills. So let's pull this out. So in Gretchen's car, she has 1,500, so 1,500 in the bank and then 2040. And now we're gonna add 200 of this. So now she has 15, 16, 17, 20, 40. So 1,740. I will fill all of the trackers and um, challenge things out later. Uh, dentist is going to get a $50 bill. My poor husband has to go get a filling. So time to stuff, stuff this back up. <laughs> Copays is going to get a five, and now Copays has 10, 15, and 20. So in the last year, several things have changed for us. Um, I left my nursing career after, after I left the nursing profession after um, 22 years um, and went to work at my husband's family business, um, and I've been there for just over a year. So things that have changed for us are we no longer have dental insurance, hence why we have to start stuffing that pretty significantly. And then our co-pays and our deductibles went up as well. So kind of a bummer, but um, the freedom um, and the uh, mental health <laughs> changes that have happened for me have been phenomenal. Um, I do miss nursing, but um, probably won't go back. I mean, my license is still active and I plan on keeping it that way, but um, yeah, I just enjoy not working weekends, holidays, long days. Um, so we shall see. Obviously, if anything happens with the economy um, and the business takes a hit, I do have the option of going back if I need to. So anyway, long rant about my deductible co-pays and dental. So on to vet. Vet's going to get $5. And then now it just has 10 Uh, pest control is going to get three dollars. That's a weird amount, but I think I did it because it'll make it so it has forty-five dollars in here. So twenty, forty, one, two, three, four, and five. Yep. They are due to come in April to check. We when we goodness, probably fifteen years ago we had termites. Um it might have been longer than that, but anyway, since then we have traps that they come and they check and they put new traps in and new bait in so that they go to eat that and not my house. <laughs> um, and they also spray around the outside of it so we don't get spiders and stuff inside the house, which I appreciate because I do not like spiders. They are my, I'm terrified of them. Absolutely terrified. I can't kill them. I can't do anything. So if my husband or my kids aren't home, I freak out. Anyway, a little side note about Sarah. <laughs> You're welcome. Um, in City, we're putting $50. So now City has 51, 20, 30, 35, and 40. I think our bill is 250 this quarter. So um, car registration, we just paid that, but I'm going to start stocking it up again. So I'm going to put a five in here. And I created this cute little tracker um, so that we can save up. I haven't, it's only, it's for $10 each and I'm only putting a five. So I'll just color half of a car when I color it in. And then taxes is going to get 10. So now in taxes, we have 20, 30, 35, and 40. 
uh, car maintenance is going to get $30. So, and that's all that it has. I just kind of tried to stuff the um, amount. You know what? I didn't plan for a buffer. Oh, well, that's fine. All right, that's it in the purple one. Next up is going to be our holidays. Nope, we're going to do the white one. All right, starting off with vacation. So currently, oh, put my tracker back here. In vacation, we have one, two, three, four hundred in the bank, and then a twenty, and we are going to add a hundred dollars to that. So I, one, two, three, four. I will probably end up just depositing this back into the bank and then putting a, uh, my, one of my $500 trackers in here since it's kind of tight with all four of those 100s. So anyway, uh, snowboard gear is going to get a 50. So now in snowboard gear, we have 100, 50, 250, 55, and 60. And with that, I will be able to purchase our two snowboard bags, uh, travel snowboard bags for my daughters so that we can fly out to Colorado in March. Uh, Beauty is going to get 30. I'm getting a haircut this week. Just a little trim. Uh, backstory, I stopped coloring my hair. So now I just go in for haircuts. It's been weird. <laughs> 20, 30, 40, 50, 55. The, I think the weirdest thing for me is that suddenly I don't enjoy going anymore. Like I used to love it. it used to be my my me time, but I don't. I just don't enjoy going to get my hair done or my nails. And I used to love that as well. Um, these are press ons, and this has been a much uh, more frugal way for me to do my nails. And I love them. They last for a week and a half, sometimes two weeks. And if I want to change them out earlier, I do. <laughs> Um, birthdays is going to get a $5 bill and that is all that it has. Advocare, $5. That's all that it has. We just bought some, so. Advocare annual fee is getting a $5 bill as well. Amazon Prime, $5 bill as well. <laughs> Sorry, this is so boring, you guys. Amazon Prime now has $10. Oops. Slide in there. Clothing. Is getting five dollars. Oh, uh, open house. This is my daughter's open house. She's a senior this year, so I have to start bulking this up. But for today, she's just getting a five dollar bill. So 20, 30, and five in open house. Gretchen's senior year. She's a freshman this year, but I need to start getting some money around because I realize how expensive their senior year is. Whoops. I only want one five. So she just has five dollars in there. Skincare, five dollars. Pet sitter, that one is getting a little bit more. That one's gonna get a fifty dollar bill. So now in pet sitter, pet sitter, we have 50, 70, 80, and five. So we were able to hire uh, one of my oldest daughter's soccer teammates um, to come and stay with our kitty cats while we're gone. So thank goodness. Um, household is getting 10. Maybe. That's all that it has. And lawn care is a brand new one that my husband was like, hey, um, I'm going to need to have to start saving for fertilizer and grass seed and all the things, right, for lawn care. So... We're just going to start this little guy off with a $5 bill. And that is it in my white binder. All right. Whoops. Forgot to put that away. Um, next up, we have uh, Christmas. Christmas is getting um, $30. And that one is going to go right into my great niece's... Avery into her binder. So a 20 and a 10. And the best part about this, you guys, which I know it does, like, when I'm like, oh, I'm just putting $30 in here. I have three envelopes that have $30 in them, and then I have this one up front that has 20. So we've already saved over $100 for Christmas, and it's February. That's the best I've ever done. I'm so excited. 
Uh, next up is holiday savings, and this bad boy takes me a while, so I might get a little chatty during it, or I might do the opposite and not talk at all. Who knows? <laughs> so Valentine's Day, we literally just depleted this whole thing. So we're going to put $5 and get it ready for next year, which is amazing because that's not something that I've ever done. Prepared a year, and a, head, a year ahead for a little holiday like Valentine's Day? Nonsense. Um, so Easter now has 20, 25, and 30. I think the rest of these all should have $30 as I add this extra $5 bill to them. So, yep. Speaking of Valentine's Day, how was everybody's Valentine's Day? I mentioned in my last video that um, my husband and I were able to go out to a pretty nice dinner um, to one of our little favorite spots. Um, and then afterwards we went and watched my daughter play soccer, which her game started an hour later than we were told. So that was fun. <laughs> oh, well, it is what it is. The worst part of the night is that they ended up losing, but that's okay. They played good, especially my daughter. I'm not going to lie. I'm not just saying that because I'm her mom, but she literally played her little heart out. She had probably four or five shots on goal, and that goalie was just so good that I just didn't get it past him. So that's okay. Tomorrow, my husband and my youngest and I are headed up to go snowboarding. Um, we, a little place that's about an hour and a half away from us that um, we have... Um, Oh my goodness, weekend season passes too. Um, we've gone twice already this year, um, and this will be the third time. And I think if we go three times, we get our money's worth. So um, unfortunately, my oldest has to work all weekend, so she's not able to come, which is a bummer. So super sad about that, but that's okay. Okay, and last, but certainly not least, whoops. Uh, we're going to go into my savings uh, my savings challenges and emergency fund binder. And I am so excited, you guys, because um, I bought this lovely dashboard from the Aesthetic Dollar. Um, and it just came in yesterday. So I added it to this one. I just think it's so, so cute. Oh, I, I love it. Simple. It's, it's perfect. Um, so I added it to this one. I also got, oh, let me show you, from her Imperfect Sale, this beautiful A5 binder. Oh my gosh. I don't know what's imperfect about it because it looks perfect to me, but, um, I am going to try and when I'm done with this video, um, combine my regular planner and my financial planner in here and see if I can get both of them into one. We'll see. Okay. Anyway, back on to, so I, many of you know, I finished my, um, 50 envelope challenge. Um, and was able to save up and pay off $1,280. I didn't pay off. I put a large payment towards my credit card. Um, and my next one that I'm going to start is a 30 day savings that I'll save $500, but I'm not going to start that one until the 1st of March. In the meantime, I'm just going to throw any extra money we have right into our extra debt envelope. So, but I do have this February savings challenge that we're going to put $45 in. Let's scratch this off. All right, and then see what we got. Okay, so now in the February challenge, we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 5, and 10. That's nice. One more to go. Whoops, let's get you in here. Okay, and then into extra debt envelope. We're putting 165 that I budgeted, but I also have an extra $6 that I pulled out of my wallet. So we're gonna add that as well. So now an extra debt, oops, we have 150, 60, 65, 70, and 71. I love it. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. That is all I have for you today. 
thank you, thank you, thank you for joining me on my journey um, and for subscribing and liking and sharing. Um, you guys have literally no idea how much it means to me that you're watching and supporting me. Um, I need it. I need all the support I can get. Uh, I have tried several times in my married life and my when I was single to get ahead of debt and pay it off. And I've done it a couple times, but man, I need it to stick this time. So all the accountability that I need is from you guys. I appreciate all of you so much and have a wonderful weekend and I will see you on my next video. Bye-bye.